supermarket broths and stocks are very convenient, but frankly, almost all of the options are terrible. I mean, really, really bad. Dozens of products that we have tasted over the years, and most of them we can't recommend. They either have no flavor or they have off flavors. Many of them remind me of like old socks. So I only brought the things we like here today. We've got chicken stock, vegetable stock, and beef stock. I'm gonna start with our favorite chicken stock. So this is from Swanson. This is one of the few products where you read the label and you're like, huh, it reads like homemade. It's basically chicken, salt, and vegetables. It has a nice, clean flavor, and it is our top choice when it comes to chicken stock. That said, if you're someone who finds that you never actually finish these big containers and you're throwing out broth, I do have another option. This is actually our best buy. It's better than bouillon chicken base. It keeps for months in the fridge. This little jar makes 38 cups of broth. You simply take a teaspoon of the base and reconstitute it in a cup of hot water. Now at home, I actually use a little bit less, maybe three quarters of a teaspoon, because I find that this can be a little salty, especially in dishes like risotto or sauces that are cooking down. It's a great option if convenience and small packages are your primary concern. Now, nine out of 10 recipes are gonna call for chicken stock. It's got a neutral, savory flavor. Vegetable stock is often very sweet, and beef stock's really very beefy and meaty, and often you don't want those notes. That said, if you're a vegetarian, you're gonna want a vegetarian broth, and this is actually our winner. It's from Orrington Farms. It is vegan chicken flavored, and it's about as natural as it sounds. You read the label, and there's a lot of things that are not vegetables here, but it actually works. You don't get a lot of vegetable flavor, but you do get a lot of robust, generally savoriness from this broth. The yeast extract is the key ingredient that really is driving the flavor in this choice. Last but not least, when you need beef broth, let's say a beef soup, also better than bouillon, this is our favorite. It's got, again, a super beefy, savory flavor. This has not only the yeast extract, but hydrolyzed soy protein, which basically supercharges the flavor and you get a lot of umami. So while there are many bad choices in the supermarket, there are four good choices next time you're looking to save some time in the kitchen. Thanks for watching Cook's Country from America's Test Kitchen. So what'd you think? Leave a comment and let us know which recipes you're excited to make or just say hi. Now you can find links to today's recipes and reviews in the video description. And don't forget to subscribe to our channel. See you later. Alligator. <laughs>